but the centerpiece is the easiest way to dress it all up. We have floral designer extraordinaire Kanan Marshall here to show us how to make a Thanksgiving centerpiece to wow our friends and family. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, welcome. Thank you. Glad I'm here. glad to hear, be here. Okay, so I am not I'm not artistic. I'm not crafty, so I'm a little bit nervous about making this. On a scale of one to ten, how hard? Oh, it's not that hard. It just give about like a five. So <laughs> okay. I always start out with hydrangeas, and that always help put your arrangement and that's your focus. But also, you know, for the holidays, you know, we have Thanksgiving. Let's add some vegetables and Ooh, fruit to your arrangement. So it. I added pomegranates, artichoke, cauliflower. I put tulips, lilies, roses. So it just helped give you a great palette for the holiday. And the color. Loving oh, the yes. pops of color. I mean, you know, orange is the new black, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> So, you know, I always say infuse things that you love and pull out of your garden and, and become friends with your neighbors because, you know, you might need to borrow something from That's your true. neighbor. Very true. Very true. And I love how you put pumpkins in there. Oh, yes. You got to add the pumpkins yeah. because I put everything on a dowel and I stick it inside of the arrangement. And so that how for you get this beautiful palette. Sure. Okay. Um, I use tulips. Tulips, when you cut tulips, you know, they grow an inch. But I usually put a little vodka in the water. That's a quick tip. Mm. A little vodka in the water and it helps the tulips not to grow so fast. Good to but know. it makes us fall over. Okay. <laughs> Exactly, right? Yes, just a little bit of that. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. But, you know, also lilies. Lilies is a great way to fill Beautiful. a space in your arrangement. I usually de um, um, thorn them and make sure I cut them and I stick them into my arrangement. Okay. Is there a secret to the shape? here it's for really getting not the a shape that you uh, We have like different terms called roundy moundy. Um, you want to go kind of with greens, different things. I think it's up to you and your palette and what you like and what your dining room table could hold. Okay, I, I, through here, I think, I'm trying to look through. Do I see grapes? Oh, yeah, we have in the, grapes. Okay, you weren't I mean, kidding when you oh, said putting in. Bring, bring in the real thing. <laughs> bring in your fruits there and vegetables are. and pumpkins. And therefore, that. it makes a great or centerpiece and arrangement for your table. Oh, I, I love mean, this. this. And, you know, roses is a great palette also. I use a blow in them. <laughs> Smell that rose. Mm, uh huh. Wow. And I use a blow and I pull them back a little bit and then I cut them and I add to my centerpiece. So don't be afraid to add and move on. Yeah. And you know, people feel like they might break them and make feel like they are, you know, I don't know what to do. Just put it in there. Move on. I like this. It, it seems like it's a little bit of this, a little bit of that, and you can be creative and put in there what you want. Just go yes, for it. Just go for it. It's the holidays. And you know, if they're family and friends, they would not say it looks <laughs> ugly. They just say it looks different. <laughs> <laughs> it looks different. It's unique. Unique it's at that unique. point in time. So also just be, a, you know, look, you know who's coming over, but also just be engaged and also bring in things that you love. Yeah. And so your your guests would love to see that. Fantastic idea. Over. Hey, and if it looks anything close to this, then you've done a, a good job. That's absolutely beautiful. Kanan <laughs> Marshall you. with us today. Kanan, thank you. Thank you so thank much. You thank tips. you. Thank beautiful. You. If you want to learn more about Kanan Marshall and his designing or also this Thanksgiving centerpiece, you can use the Fox 5 Atlanta app or go to fox5atlanta.com and look for the viewer information story. You know, it's pretty hard to think about Thanksgiving when it's as warm as it is outside, <laughs> but let's check in with Fox 5 Storm Team Meteorologist Joanne Feldman Hi. for an update. Yeah, near record warmth today. Wow. So here